Today, we take ourselves out of the usual routine and the daily living to witness a unique moment in the lives of Vanessa and Shane. Today, they join their lives together in the union of marriage. Vanessa, I didn't write down any vows because there's nothing that I could have written down that would match the way that I'm feeling for you right now as you stand before me. I wanted to speak directly from the heart and directly to you and be as pure as I could possibly be. Six years ago, I was at the University of Oklahoma. And when I started in August 2015, there was this girl. She was in every one of my classes. And that girl was you. And when I say these out loud, the sequence of events, there's only one thing that can truly explain how this happened, and it's, it's fate. Fate is what brought us here. Fate is what brought each other, us into each other's lives and what has brought us here today. So while I don't have anything formally prepared in terms of vows, I do have a couple that come to mind that I want to share with you today. I vow to be your partner throughout life because as a team, the things that we can do are unimaginable and we will be truly unstoppable. I vow to support you in everything that you do. And I vow to accept your support for anything that I choose to do as well, the acceptance of your support. I vow to care about you, to love you, to take care of you, to provide for you, to be the best husband that I can be, and to be the best future father that I can be to our children. No matter what happens, the ups and downs in life, I vow to always love you because our love will be strong. It'll be stronger to withstand any storm that may come our way. And lastly, and most importantly, I vow to keep you well fed with the best pizza that money can buy. Shane, or how I like to say it's Shaner. Where do I begin? Feels like just yesterday we were sitting in Barcima still trying to figure out our lives. <laughs> and now we're here getting married. Even the day you finally asked me, again, to be your girlfriend, I wasn't ready. But honestly, the timing couldn't be any more perfect. You were exactly what I needed, and you stayed patient with me since the day I met you. I can't imagine a life without you anymore. You're patient, kind, forgiving, and so thoughtful. I'm honestly the luckiest girl in the world, and you're perfect for me. I love you, Shane. I vow to be your constant, no matter what's thrown at us, as life is always full of surprises, as Lorelai said it best. You have so many years and screw-ups ahead of you. I can't wait to do every screw-up with you. I vow to continue to make you eat way too much pizza and rewatch Gilmore Girls until the end of time. I vow to keep you on your toes until death do us part. And as Jeff said best, your favorite character, think how dull your life would be without me. And as Luke Pence famously said, I just want you to know I'm in. I'm all in. With whatever and wherever, I'm all in. I promise to love you the same as you love me since the day you met me and you told your mom you were going to marry me. This is one chapter that is closed, but a new adventure that I cannot wait to embark on with you. Thank you for officially being my Luke. Again, <laughs> I love you, Shane. Now let's do this so we can get our pizza party started. <laughs>